Diving in these clear waters is the perfect opportunity to see what's really going on down there. I've chosen a stretch river that has a lot of sunken logs and debris. I think this could be a good place for catfish. But diving here is gonna be dangerous. There are a lot of obstacles. If I get stuck on a branch, I get stuck on a log, I could be in real trouble. I'm gonna have to be careful. It's like another world down there. I see a shape down below me, and as I look more closely, I can see it's a Wells catfish. It proves that I'm fishing in the right location. and I go up a little bit shallower to a submerged tree, and I see one of the craziest things I've ever seen. A group of Wells catfish all sitting together, totally stationary in a bush. It reminds me of a bunch of vultures sitting in a tree. And they're not moving. It's almost like they're hypnotized and they don't seem to be aware or bothered by my presence at all. Man, that was pretty incredible. After seeing the behavior of these Wells catfish during the day, it's obvious why I haven't been able to catch one. During the day, these fish aren't active. Some fish reduce their metabolism by sleeping or floating in place and wedging themselves into secure spots or nests. While they're still alert to danger, it's just like humans taking a power nap. <laughs> 